So I'm in the pantry. I don't have a problem. There's nothing wrong with being in the pantry. I just like spices and mixes to cook up some good food. It's 2021, you don't judge me. It's a lifestyle choice to like food and good food, healthy food. So up next, we're gonna cook up some delicious meals for your family. Stay tuned. Welcome, and we are uh, here making some crispy, crunchy lettuce wraps, one of the new uh, products from Epicare um, in the winter and spring catalog that just was released. Uh, so just to give you an idea, you just saw me doing a little bit of prepping. Um, I was dicing some chicken. This recipe actually calls for ground pork, but I'm trying it out with some finely diced chicken breast. And then I diced up my two bell peppers, and then I had actually pre, um, kind of prehydrated my seasoning, so I put my uh, soy sauce, my water, and my sesame oil in this little prep bowl and got that kind of hydrating. Um, we'll just mix it up a little bit here, make sure it's good and um, absorbed, but uh, definitely don't have to do this. You can kind of add it all together. The directions basically just tell you to um, do your diced, or your, excuse me, your ground pork, your bell pepper, soy sauce, water, and sesame oil all together in the pan and uh, fry it up. So here we go. We're going to start frying up our chicken and adding our seasoning. So the nice thing about this recipe is everything's kind of all going in at once. Uh, not too much prep involved. Uh, if you have little people that maybe don't like bell peppers, you could totally cook these on the side and add them to your own uh, as to accommodate likings of individual family members. But in our case, we're gonna throw them in. If the kiddos don't want them, they can pick them up. And then we uh, will throw in our seasoning here. So again, this is the crispy, crunchy lettuce wraps heard lots of great things about these, so I'm super excited to give them a go. Uh, just another way to switch this up if you wanted to. So I'm doing the diced chicken breast, but you could also do ground turkey or ground chicken, um, or even ground beef. I feel like this would be a good one for, for ground beef as well. Uh, and then you're just serving it basically over uh, a leaf of lettuce and this makes eight portions. So then to perfectly balance your plate, you're going to uh, do two uh, lettuce leaves full of your mixture. Um, and so yeah, this is a nice healthy portion for a family. Turn up my heat a little bit here so we can get things rolling. I put a little bit of avocado oil in the pan before I started, just to keep things from sticking. Oh, this smell is delicious. All right, we'll be back shortly to give you a recap on the finished product. All right, we're back at you here. We are just Browning up our meat, it's almost done here. I'll give you a little look at that. I have a little companion with me now. Came in from outside while I'm playing. So he's here to help mom um, finish up this recipe. So one of the things that we are um, gonna top this uh, crispy crunchy lettuce wrap with is one of my favorite um, sauces, dressings. It's uh, creamy sesame ginger. And so I will show you here what that looks like. So um, we have the soy sauce, rice vinegar, mayo, and the sesame ginger are the ingredients that go into it. Um, 
And uh, yeah, we also generally make like probably a triple portion of this because we really like it on salads and, and different things like that. So that'll, that'll be our topper for this instead of the sriracha or the hoisin. Okay, so here we have the final product. Um, just a note about balancing your plate. So a cup of rice as your uh, starch and then uh, doubled up the romaine lettuce. You could use any kind of lettuce that you want. And then it's half a cup of um, mixture on each one to give you a perfectly perfectly balanced plate or a perfectly portioned plate. Um, and then this is the sauce that I was um, noting earlier. And so then we just do a little drizzle of that on top. Um, just like so. And that's it. Then it's done, you're ready to eat. I'm gonna take a little bite and see how it is. So good.